Of course, um, Michael, your wonderful husband. I have the to same. call him Mr. Spain. I I've know. never called him Michael. <laughs> you know, he goes everywhere now. Mr. Spain! <laughs> you, I'm who's a doing the now, cooking? Aren't I? You're, you're, you're... I'm a carer. <laughs> <laughs> but we have to give him a round of applause because I have this thing about Christmas, right? Absolutely obsessed with Christmas. And the one thing was, and can I put straight also, I did not decide to die mm. in November. No. What I did was I went, because I was in pain, and the, and the, and I have to say the bad bits are, that, you know, I mm. could rob a bank because I've got no fingerprints mm. and, and, um... Have you thought about this? I have. Yeah. Well, I thought I'd come to you, love. I thought yeah. we'd have a little yeah. smash and grab job. Two and six. Oh, yeah, because I can be caught and locked off. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> oh, great, thanks, Linda. But I'll be very nice about you. <laughs> Thank you. You know, and how Thank much you. we need you. <laughs> um, but, but, yes, and when you're in pain, you, you say things. Yeah. But, again, after the operation, no control. That's what I hate, mm. you know. Your body just throws these things at you. So I went to the oncologist and I said, look, I do not want my husband and my children to remember me ill i'd, I'd like them to re we all know i'm ill mm. but i want i want to go just you know just good night mm -hmm. and mm. so can i have a little box in which i put the the ability to make that decision and i know it's really weird but we talked about it for a year as i say me and the boys and michael it gave me something it may, it was a relief to think well if all else fails I could, nobody's going to have a go at me. I'm going to turn around and say, switch off the chemo and let's see what happens. That's, that's the biggest thing. Mm. And as I keep saying, how embarrassing if I don't die because <laughs> people will think I just did it to sell the book. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't the other thing... <laughs> really? Isn't the other thing that gives you control? You've kept your dignity. Thank you, you have. Well, coming totally. from master of, I think. Well, no. <laughs> I mean, that's why I loved working with you, because you, t you say it how it is, but you're, you say it in a way that doesn't upset people, you're very forthright, you're very direct, but you know exactly what you want and no-one's going to deviate you. Mm. But you know what's weird? That, uh, um, what's been so wonderful about this year uh, is that I've learnt so much from people, first of all, and I, you know when you get a bit cynical <laughs> in life, and, um, <laughs> and they say yet again, I'm so sorry, you're not right for this part. <laughs> yeah. um, you learn so much, and the biggest thing, because I, as you know, I'm not very confrontational, am I? I'm, no. I'm a bit of a weed. Well, of course, I've become very <laughs> grumpy. <Yeah. laughs> you know, and I, but it's amazing to be able to say things to people, and it's taken me 66 years, Janet, to find.